Solubility Testing the solubility of organic compounds Solubility is a property referring to the ability for a given substance, the solute, to dissolve in a solvent. The first organic compound being tested is glucose, by testing its solubility in water. After adding a few milliliters of water, stir with a glass rod. After some light stirring, the solid disappears. This means that it is soluble in water as we knew it would be. The next substance we are looking at is 4-nitrobenzoic acid. First, we'll see its solubility in water. Take a look at its structure and guess if you think it will be soluble or not. After stirring, we can see that it is not soluble in water. This begs the question, what can we do to make it soluble in water? Again, refer to its structure and consider the following reaction. 4-nitrobenzoic acid will react with a base, in this case 5% sodium hydroxide, and form a sodium salt which is soluble in water. Here we add 5% sodium hydroxide, and after stirring we can see it does dissolve meaning that it became soluble in water. Next, we will look at para-anisidine, a base, and its water solubility. Look at its structure and make your prediction on if it will be water soluble. When we add water, we can see that it is not soluble. What can we do this time to make it water soluble? We know it's a base, so if we add an acid, we can once again turn it into a water-soluble salt. This time, we'll add 5% hydrochloric acid. When we do this, we can see that after a little stirring, it dissolves, meaning that it became water-soluble. The most effective way of determining and classifying solubility is by using a solubility tree. In the lab handout, you can find the following tree. The first step in this tree is determining the solubility of each chemical in water. If it is soluble in water, you can then test the solubility in ether, which will allow further classification into group 1 or group 2. Similarly, if a chemical is not water soluble, you can test its solubility with an acid or a base and further classify into group 3, 4, 5, or 6. Observe and make note of the solubility of each chemical in either water or ether, then classify according to the solubility tree. Note that some of the chemicals we are testing will be solids and others will be liquids. First is solubility in water, here is glucose, ethyl acetate, toluene, 4-ethylphenol, benzyl alcohol, tributylamine, P-anisidine, ethyl benzoate, para-nitrobenzoic acid, acetanilide. Next, we'll be looking at the solubility in ether. Again, first is glucose. ethyl acetate, toluene, tributylamine, 4-ethylphenol, benzyl alcohol, paraanisidine, ethyl benzoate, 4-nitrobenzoic acid, acetanilide. 